set some expectations here before we start streaming. So get your Richard Sherman memes ready. I can feel them already. My announcement is we're not announcing anything during the stream. We are playing Crash Bandicoot, as we said. What was the, the biggest mistake probably was uh, saying there was going to be a giant announcement. To me, DLC 2 is a big announcement. There's a huge team that works on that very hard. And for me, anytime you get new content in the game is exciting. So I was excited about it. We hadn't officially announced it yet at the time. I knew that was coming up very soon, so I wanted to talk about it. Yeah, believe me, I cannot... I have no power to announce anything. I'm literally the lowest man on the totem pole. I mean, there's probably... Well, I guess I really don't know what to say about this point. Oh, you really, I guess, I, I, I just don't know what to say about this at all. A lot of us came to the Call of Duty stream, uh, the Activision stream, to find out if there was going to be Call of Duty news or some Spyro news. I, you know, the kind of the chat was kind of like a mixture of shit in that point, and uh, we didn't hear anything. And I guess that's what's scary to a lot of Call of Duty fans at this point right now in time. And um, I guess we were expecting some like Call of Duty news or. Something. I don't know. We were just expecting something out of that live stream. and You know, I, uh, yeah. Kevin Kelly said that, you know, there would be a big announcement and stuff like that last week in the stream on Wednesday last week. And um, I guess the announcement ended up turning out to be the, the, the DLC arrival of Call of Duty World War II. That is honestly, like, kind of surprising that the DLC is a big announcement. As, as you guys heard, you know, some people, yeah, of course some people are going to think that. It's a big announcement and stuff like that. Some people do like Call of Duty World War II. You know, I, I don't hate the game. Uh, as, as you guys can probably tell from my normal voice and stuff, like I just I'm just disappointed. I just thought we were gonna get something and we never did. And it just don't and like don't like like what what I, I don't want you guys to send like hate. And I know we're small as fuck, but I don't want you guys to send like hate to Kevin Kelly. Like that's not fair to him, especially. You know, he's just he's just someone that's doing some streams and shit for Activision. You know. I'd, He's, he also said on his stream that he, you know, he's a he's the lowest dude. You know, he doesn't have like any information or really, he's like the second lowest guy, which I kind of think is bullshit in a way. But you know, whatever. But I, I definitely don't. You know, he doesn't deserve any like hate or like people to like hate on him or any crazy shit. Okay, guys. So if we could just like show up, just like trying to like, I don't know, keep that down, dude. Like I, I don't know. You know, my last five videos are my last five videos. Four of them are about. Call of Duty um, Modern Warfare 2 being remastered. You know, I wanted this to come true. I wanted the hype to come true, you know what I mean? I just really want to get that point across to everybody, you know? Like, don't send some, like, bullshit hate because it's really not his fault. You know, it's not Kevin Kelly's fault, you know? Uh, we're all humans. We make mistakes and shit like that. So, like, just don't send any hate. It, right now, it doesn't look like we're going to get Modern Warfare 2 remastered anytime soon or anything like that. Honestly, I'd stay, like, pretty close to Charlie Intel's side about everything that you hear. A lot of people kind of came out of the wet works out of nowhere about this whole entire leaking and shit like that and uh it basically created just false hope so it don't feed into like people's false hope and shit like that and these fake leaker motherfuckers that are out here out here just like acting like they have an actual source which they're just making shit up or they read too far into something now if now if tomorrow something does get released or some shit like that then i'm just the idiot sitting here in front of the you know microphone and camera being a complete moron and you guys can hate on me for that. You know, at least at least I'm not one of these motherfuckers that sat around here saying that, oh, no, 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 it's, it's coming for sure. You know it's coming. No, I never said shit like that, okay? I said just just keep watching and make, you know, it, there might be a release or announcement, or there should be. I just can't believe this DLC 2 was the big announcement. I mean, I guess that's kind of a shocker to a lot of us and shit like that, a lot of people. And uh, this is definitely going to be a different weird video for my channel. Um, mostly I like to have fun as fuck on here, and it's, you know, this this is a pretty big disappointment so yeah i just really want to let you guys know that out of this whole live stream and shit like that we didn't hear anything um there was no announcements no nothing pretty much nothing other than the big announcement that uh kevin kelly was saying was basically the dlc was the big announcement um and stuff like that so if i look disappointed to you guys or seem kind of sad about it i'm not really sad just disappointed i think a lot of people are i think a lot of people are more mad than anything right now I'll let you guys know if, like, anything, like, actually happens with Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 being remastered. Like, actual shit. Like, Activision comes out and actually says something. But until then, it's... I'm staying off this topic. It's... Right now, it's... It's just not a good idea. Like, for me, anyway. It's... I think to come off the hype train, it, it, it feels pretty good. Alright, guys. Like, 
I would have much rather had like I would have much rather had them say like reveal it, you know, say something about it, talk about it a little bit. But um, I think now after like kind of coming to like the realization that this might not be coming as soon as we thought or coming at all, that you know it's kind of nice just to like be like all right, you know, kind of come to peace with it. I know it's not gonna come to peace with everybody as fast as it did for me because I, I legitimately in the past couple of days I've been like, this shit ain't real. This shit isn't coming. Uh, Charlie Intel, Eurogamer. Um, Kotaku, none of the motherfuckers have said anything really about it. All these people that kind of came out of nowhere have kind of started talking about it just a little bit. And, um, yeah, it's, it's ball bullshit, okay? We, I, you can spell bullshit from a mile away with some of these people. And some of these people, you know, it, it actually sounds like they know what the fuck they're talking about. Um, and I want that motherfucker to delete his account. You know who I'm talking about. All right, guys, it's Premiere. Hope the rest of your day is the best of your day, guys. Peace, peace.